We have brand new video just into us now. This is from the police in Nashville on the night that Riley Strain disappeared, that missing uh, Missouri student. News Nation's Caitlin Becker covering the story joins me now here in New York. All right, so that's new video that's in. What can you tell us about it? You know, Connell, with this video, I think the important part is not necessarily what we see, but what we don't see. And I think we can take a look at a little bit more of that right now. So you're seeing this here. This is body cam footage from an officer who is there looking at a potential car burglary. Now, he interacts with Riley Strain, who is just kind of walking by, and it's very cordial. That's Riley Strain right there. They just do a quick back and forth. Hey, how's it going? What's important here is that he's not stumbling. He doesn't seem visibly intoxicated, or certainly as visibly intoxicated as he did in previous surveillance video, which was just from a few minutes before, which we've seen. And and officers, the officer said he didn't seem in distress. Here's that surveillance video. He can't even keep his head up straight. So I don't know if it was the presence of an officer, which may right. sober any of us up, but he didn't seem in distress. He didn't ask for directions. He didn't approach the officer for help. So that I think is very telling and a little bit concerning. I don't know what that necessarily means yeah. for the continuing investigation there because he did have an opportunity to talk to an officer and get help, but it was just very now, the time how you doing. Stamp, sorry, the the time stamp on this is, is close, then, you're saying? It's, it, it's very... This is very, very close. So what you're seeing in that sort of stumbling video right. is him after he had gotten kicked out of a bar for being too intoxicated. Yeah, we saw that last we week. We saw that last week. Right. And so this th that happened about 9.35-ish, 9.40-ish. And then beyond 9.52, which is that sort of last sighting that we just see, we don't have any idea where he went. The other piece that just came out this weekend, Connell, is mm -hmm. that Riley Strain's bank card was found in a river embankment right around this area. And right. last week, we know that Nashville Metro PD said that they were searching that river embankment. So that is another kind of crucial piece that has been picked up. So that's where we are right now in the investigation. We have the bank card and we have this video. Um, and that's really all, that's what they're going that's on. That's really what they're going off of. I mean, we don't have updates whether or not his um, cell phone locations have come back yet. He did try to make a phone call around 10 p.m., but right. beyond that, we really don't know. And his family obviously really does want answers. They're actually going to be on Banfield tonight speaking to our Ashley yes. Banfield. And investigators did say that they met with detectives today. They were shown footage, so they might have some updates from their end about where this investigation mm -hmm. is. But it does seem like he kind of vanished into thin air. But well, between, he had an Apple Watch I saw, but then it wasn't set up or something. They so. don't. I don't know if they have that info back right. quite yet. Okay. But yeah, he had that Apple Watch. But we have a kind of an, a locator with this video and where the bank card was. It concerns me that it's on a riverbank and yeah. that we did see him intoxicated. So I don't know if that might be the next turn. But officers and investigators have said no foul play is suspected, and they are still treating this as, as a missing person. Case. All right, Caitlin, thanks for walking um, us through all of that. Obviously, we'll stay on top of this. And to Caitlin's point tonight, um, uh, tune in to, to Banfield because Riley Strain's family will be joining Ashley. That's 10 p.m. Eastern here on News Nation. Thanks so much for watching. Just go to joinnn.com to find News Nation on your television provider. And don't forget to click the red subscribe button below to get more of News Nation's fact driven, unbiased coverage.